Hey guys, what I typically like to do is for every 10 new subscribers, I record a slightly more elaborate video with more kind of editing done to it. So as you can see, I'm in my backyard. It's Thursday morning. I'm just uh, chilling before work starts. It's a little, it's raining a little bit. Hopefully <laughs> I can uh, spend some time here. Um, so just want to tell you what I've been up to and hope you guys are all staying safe and uh, quarantined and practicing social distancing and all that. I've uh, been recording a lot. Just uh, yesterday I recorded a string and a flute arrangement. So this is the first time I'm recording myself on flute. My flute debut. <laughs> Um, the day before I recorded uh, euphoniums. <laughs> So a debut for me. Never recorded euphoniums before. So it came out sounding like <laughs> French horns or something like that. Um, yeah, and I'm just happy that I, I'm, I guess, kind of lucky that I have my own backyard space where I can chill before work starts. So I'm in isolation, but at the same time, being outdoors, I think it's. <sighs> When, when this is all over, <laughs> I'll definitely have a barbecue, as I typically do several times a year. I'll project something on this wall. Um, maybe a movie. Maybe we'll all space out and watch a movie. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to tell you, before this whole thing kind of went out of control, I. I was uh, going to go on vacation and I had to uh, cut my vacation short. Every couple of years I like to go on a road trip. I think it's, to me personally, it's the most relaxing thing to drive, just drive for hours and hours and hours. So my planned vacation was to go to Nashville and then Louisville. So basically, oh, also stop by Graceland. So it was a big kind of, <laughs> South uh, uh, exploration thing, and uh, I unfortunately had to cut it short because I, at first I thought, you know, maybe I'll just get lucky. But when I got to Nashville, that night was the last night before the uh, lockdown effectively began. It wasn't really a lockdown as much as a recommendation. The the next day venues were still operating but a lot of them were closed down and uh, but I I got to visit the Musicians Hall of Fame Museum with uh, there's a picture of me with uh, Mr. Joe Chambers the the founder of the museum it's a really really neat place and I know that it's closed right now but when it reopens when the whole thing is over please do yourselves a favor go visit Nashville this is the birthplace of country music and that museum is amazing to look at James Jamerson's bass that was used on countless recordings is great so yes I unfortunately had to cut the cut my trip short and uh, <laughs> I remember I woke up and uh, I drove back something like 14 hours pretty much straight I don't recommend that that's not very enjoyable towards the end I was just struggling to stay awake I opened all the windows I was blaring music I keep I kept drinking I kept drinking coffee and energy drinks it was, it was horrible oh and also <laughs> to add to this like apocalyptic uh, atmosphere I was I was I was uh, I was uh, freaking listening to audiobooks, Ray Bradbury, 
Oh my god, <laughs> Fahrenheit. Oh my god, it was that was surreal, especially you know, no, uh, seeing this kind of invisible, <laughs> invisible thing creeping. Uh, it's it's something else. I it was I was really in the zone for Fahrenheit for for fifty one. Uh, while knowing that maybe the the world is about to end soon, in reality is quite something. Well, like I said, hope you're doing well. Hope you're self isolating. Use technology to talk to people. Uh, don't be stupid. Don't congregate. Uh, instead, do a video call. And uh, when this is all over, hope to see you in person. Have a good one.